up guys it is Elon Jason Try and today we came back it's been a while today was Thanksgiving it been? it's been about like three months three months <laughs> yeah yeah we went to Cracker Barrel today and as you know they have an old country store it's almost like a convenience store but bigger I have a lot of candy which is perfect for um, Eli and Jason Try so um First off, we're just going to show what all we got. Um, we went to eat Thanksgiving, so happy Thanksgiving. Um, to happy all those Thanksgiving. moms out there, I guess it's Merry Christmas. But um, today, <laughs> we got full Hilarious. gumballs. And I thought this was very good. Um, very realistic. Very realistic. I mean, I, mean, I thought they were actually just like regular gum, Yeah, we thought it was gum, a toy yeah. that got it stuck yeah. in the candy section. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, I'm trying to show the numbers because it's cool. See, like three. But I thought it was all just the same color, but look at that. The flavors are actually different. Mm -hmm. It says... Seven o'clock. Seven o'clock. It's seven o'clock. watch always hits seven, seven o'clock. So, I really thought it was all the same um, flavor, but actually, it's not because most of the gumballs are just all the same flavor. Lemon is yellow. Um, blue raspberry is of course blue. Um, strawberries is red. Grape is purple. Orange is um, orange. Green apple is green. Cherry is red. Tutti frutti is black. That's Tutti surprising. That is surprising. I thought it was like black licorice. Yes. Of course, pineapple is expect. yellow. Mint is purple. Mint is purple. No, that's blue. Oh, mint is blue. Yeah. That's why are they? That's weird. Mint bubblegum. All right. Tutti well, mint is associated with blue color, like. Oh yeah. You see, toothpaste mint. is used. Mint. mint. Um, it's yeah, green mint actually, but for some reason, blue is also mint in our world. What we got next is Jason's childhood asteroid pop. Astro pop, yeah. It was invented or made in the 1963. Um, what was it? Astro um, it was it, yeah. It was two uh, astrophysicists that uh -huh. were working on the space program, but they quit that job Astro and started Pop. making Astro Pops. Mm, the and they capitalized off the, the space name craze, of, the space yeah. craze that was happening at that time period. Mm -hmm. And it has amazing colors. And they actually make it by mixture. pouring the sugar mixture directly mm. into the packaging. Um, has a lot of ingredients. Yeah. And this is actually the company, the original one, went out of business. Yeah. And then somebody out there actually revives old candy companies and just figures out all the machining and all the tooling to actually make it happen. So it's really cool. Yep. Okay. Lastly, I love Slime Liquor. It's already open, but I just decided, you know, I got it from Cracker Barrel. Jason has never tried it before. No. Never. Never. It's actually, I'm pretty sure it's pretty new. Um, Toxic Waste kind of came out with it like, probably three years ago or something like that. And Jason is going to be trying it for the first time. I am. So, and you've already tried it, so that'll have uh -huh. a little Eli essence yep. mixed with the <laughs> whatever it is. All right. As <laughs> always, on with the video. All right, we're back. Um, We are going to be trying them. So what should we start off first? I was thinking these because yeah. like... We'll just save the Astro Pop classic for the last. I think so. That makes perfect sense to me. Can't wait for Jason to try on me because I never tried Astro Pop. And he has when he was like 10 years old. Yeah, not since I was 10. It's about 34 years. I'd get him at Stone Mountain, Georgia. Yeah. I think, wasn't it like popular there kind of? Like, yeah, Stone it? Mountain. Yeah. It was like a whole Okay, park. scissors. Atlanta. Scissors. Where's scissors? Oh. You put the scissors. Oh. Not scissors, but a pocket knife. Pocket knife. Nice. Gotta be prepared for this. All right. Okay. You wanna try it? Yeah. All right, just be careful. We'll do like a little close-up shot. Watch your fingers. Ooh, that was perfect, yeah. I'm gonna try this first. Oh, that's like tape on the corners. And then you can like poke that All out. All right. There you go. Whoa, that's cool packaging. Look at that. You got the. That's an example of what not to do. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow. All right, let's. We 
lost a gumball. Turns out it got um, trapped in the back room, so it looks like we won't be able to see it. Yeah, there's no mint yep. happening today. Well, well not maybe really later. like mint. Probably, <laughs> maybe later. Probably off screen. Off screen, yeah. So, what number should we start off first? Um, number this one, six. Number six? What flavor is this? Let's see. Sour apple? Let's see, so... Green apple. Green apple. Wait, it shows a number. Number six, green apple, green yeah. Apple. Look at that, it's bright. Six. It does look nice. Oh yeah, that one, because we each get... Okay. All right, maybe eight. Four. Four? I see a four What's four? Four is grape. I see the grape. Yeah. It's a little hard to get out of there. Six. Got six and four. So go ahead and try it. Three, two, one. Oh. Oh. I have a crown. <laughs> Temporary. Uh, I'm not my permanent one. Me too. Oh, yeah. Mm. Mm. Why is it so hard? Mm. I mean, no longer the book of love. It's hard. Yeah. But man, it's pretty good. It's pretty easy to chew after. It tastes like old baseball card gum. <laughs> tastes just Sorry like it. If you had to hear, you had to see the inside of my mouth when I was doing. It's like oh, it's like crumbly almost. It's very greeny. Mm -hmm. It's got sweet. This doesn't taste like apple at all. I wonder what eight is. It tastes just like bubblegum flavor. Eight's tutti frutti. It smells like an ordinary gumball. <laughs> I imagine it's gonna taste like one too. These taste like they're like at least five years old. Yeah. And like, it's been sitting in a grandma's basement. Yeah, it's, they're a little musty, a little bit of mothball. Uh huh. Almost faintly like nair. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I wonder what it tastes like with Pepsi. Let's try. Does it taste like with grape? Probably tastes better. There's no grape flavor to this at all. Nah, made it ten times it tastes worse. Just like bubble gum. <laughs> I'm just excited for this. Yeah. I haven't tried, tried this for 34 years. All right. Um, let's try a new number. Um, are you keeping that one in? We could um, all right. I think we're just gonna rate it out of 10. Let's see. So, you got grape and I got green apple. I'll, I'll start rating first. Let's rate out of 10. Um, honestly, it still tastes like a grandma's basement forever. I'm guessing I'd give it, but it does have a good flavor. So, 7 out of 10. 7.5 out of 10. 7.5. Um, I'm it tastes, it's kind of nostalgic because it tastes like baseball card gum. Yeah. Um, that's basically what it's got going on for me. It's kind of grainy and the flavor doesn't last long at all. Yeah, it doesn't at all. I give it a 5. 5 for the fact that even to manufacture something like this, I don't really know how it's done. So I yeah. appreciate that somebody could make this. But I wouldn't buy it again. Mm -hmm. I don't want it either. It's kind of like a one-time only. But it's a good novelty gift. Mm -hmm. I might give it to somebody else with a disclaimer. All right. Well, we'll just try new numbers. So when we're done chewing, we're going to do the next numbers. All right. All right. We're going to try new um, numbers. Hopefully we get a better flavor. So let's just see what we have. I might get strawberry. I'm gonna, go for, I'm gonna go for pineapple. Pineapple? Ooh, I bet that tastes weird. Pineapple. The other, I'm gonna actually try lemon. lemon it's nine. another, mine's number one. You went, we went for the nine. yellows here. Yellows. Here, wait, that's, that's a cool name. That's a cool that sound. sound. Like billiard balls. I mean, they really are quite realistic little billiard balls. Yeah. They're very cool. Mm -hmm. They taste, 
I mean, they maybe it was really the flavors. Sound Let's like keep our mind open. Yeah. All right, let's okay. try it. Oh. Oh, uh, it's crumbly. Okay. Of course, this video might be longer than usual because we want to make the best reviews on snacks that you might or candy you might pop up with. So, oh, does that mean taste like lemon? Does your taste like pineapple? No, <laughs> it tastes like old bubble gum from a baseball card wrapper. Oh, still. It says they're different flavors, but... Mm. I guess I'm, I'm right. It does taste like all the same, kind of. Mm-hmm. Uh, Y'all probably had bubblegum before. <clears throat> the aftertaste <clears throat> was horrible. That's bad. To me, it is. Yeah. Choke I'm not going to last long with this. <laughs> Okay. Alright, we're just, we're done. We're doing next can. You're down a little. Alright. Are you recording? We're gonna, yep, we're gonna. Oh, I, wait, can I make a comment? No, no, record. <laughs> I just want to say that I do think that the billiard balls, they're like really spherical, much more than normal mm -hmm. gumballs. So they do have some redeeming qualities. Yeah, that's about to end the video. Alright. We're gonna start off with the slime liquor. I already had so much of this. I'm getting a headache from it, so. Are you ready? So what you do is you just lick the top, like pretty hard because it's pretty hard to spin around. So we'll just let it like. So what, you kind of get it move Get it at the end. So like mm -hmm. you can look around and it'll be on the bottom. And now what do All I do? Right. Just lick it. It's like rubber and plastic on that. I don't really like it. It doesn't even move. Try like really like licking it, like try to get your teeth with that too. Oh. oh, there it is. I saw it on the other side. See that? I don't think I understand this. Okay. I feel like I'm out of my. Try like licking it, dimension. like like go on the bottom, like spin around. Here, we'll wing it up. I've always tried to pop it off the top, but I, I don't know this delivery mechanism. Okay, I got a little there. Okay. I see. You literally have to manipulate your tongue. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's probably has a very specific market place. Yeah. I'm not part of I it. I think the market for this is not very good. You think I it's, mean, a, it's like a one-time thing? I mean, thing? honestly, toxic waste stocks. Probably they have that, but it's pretty low. Toxic but waste stocks. As soon as this came out, it's pretty good. People have been buying it because it's, of course, all over YouTube and TikTok. It's really what makes it popular. Um, I rate this five out of ten. It's not really good. Honestly, I don't know how I got. It. I don't even know how I liked it in the first place. But the blue raspberries are like headache because I bet it, it was gonna give you like nausea for like the rest of the day. Yeah. How would you rate it? I don't. Yeah, it's I, I didn't even get enough product to even. Yeah. But You're the getting like plastic or like whatever material it is on the top particles in that. Too. The positive I would say is that if you wanted to buy something that took a long time to mm -hmm. consume. It, you can't do it fast unless you break into it like you said you've done. I've tried to. You've tried to, so they've it's made it never pretty... Worked. Okay, so... Anyway, it's like something that lasts a long time. Mm -hmm. And that's about all i got to say about that. Alright. Last candy. Astro Best Astro Old school. Best old school. Alright. Alright. We are going to do the Astro Pop. 
Here, I'll look I'm at this one. I'm excited for this. I'm excited. I really have never tried it before. It looks So I believe you snip it off at the end. And then you peel it back a little. Got like a little end piece. Yeah, this is pretty much how I remember it. The mm. wrapper kind of gets stuck to it a little Whoa. bit. I tried the bottom piece. There you go. Whoa. There you go. That's weird. It does. Hmm. Was it changed Sour a app. little bit whenever you were a kid? Yeah. yeah. I think I just remember it in a certain way. I don't know if that's, you know... All right, I'm excited to try green. I don't want any comments saying like, ew, that's disgusting. That's not your life on it. They're cut. Yeah. We're always doing this, okay? I bet you do with your family also, so. It tastes kind of good. I mean, um, it's unexpected. I thought it would be like, more like flavorful, but it's not really. It's this is like more like banana kind of. It's kind of mild. And I guess the forty olds in the comments. You know, just leave a comment like I had that when I was whenever I was a child or fifty something. You could be like yeah. all the way up to eighty. Wait, how? Maybe. I thought it was invented. Seventies. Fifty nine, fifty eight. That would have said. There's... Try to look green right. inside. Of course, you probably have to get down to it. What does it taste like? Hmm, it's familiar. They all taste the same, kind yeah, of. Yeah, pretty much. It might just be food colored in there. I don't think there's any claims on the packaging or otherwise about the flavors. Maybe there is, but I didn't look at it. Looks like a rocket ship. I wonder if it's called Astro Pop. Yeah. I'm going to try to break off a piece. Pretty easy to break off a piece. Yeah, I could. Yeah. I wouldn't eat this on a daily basis. No. But it's pretty good. It's so sticky. Yeah. Oh my god. Very sticky. That's wild. Um, he claims to. So. Oh, it's different, I guess, and for him when he was a kid. Or I just don't remember. Or he doesn't remember what it tastes like. All right. Well, I give this five out of ten. I give it a six out of ten. Kind of hard to eat, and yeah, I think I feel like my teeth good, might though. fall out with it. Yeah. But it's not. Yeah, I mean, I could see certain people liking this. Yeah, me too. I'm not one of them. <laughs> all right that was a good video we did some good snacks hopefully yeah we'll do probably a christmas special yeah probably a christmas special mm -hmm. yeah or it might be seasonal you know might be seasonal maybe ever every other you know day we could do something like this it was fun going to cracker barrel today yep and showing you candy and us writing it so you don't have to be disgusted next time you try it because you'll know. Just watch this video to see if it's actually good. So, hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you like, subscribe, and have a great day. Bye. Bye.